hello guys uh, welcome to tech advice channel so friends uh, today in this video i'm going to show you the how can you uh, like if you are working with the cloud uh, platform like gcp so normally if you work uh, with a big query so sometimes we need to uh, check our data set uh, table size so uh, how can you get that one so in this video i'm going to show you that one so if you are watching this video first time so please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so so first of all uh, we have to go to our console so friend uh, here you see that uh, i already can came to my uh, cloud console uh, so here i'm just taking the pub public one uh, public uh, data set uh, so so can i show you then the public data set and so i can just choose any data set uh, so let me just uh, paste my query uh, so here you can see i have taken uh, the table id and then i just use that uh, size by bit by uh, uh, divided by a row count why i'm taking save divide because you know sometimes if uh, the size is zero of a table then it's showing that error because uh, save divide is uh, uh, to remove the, those errors zero divided by zero so uh, yep so it will show you in the mb i make a byte so I already choose uh, this uh, data set so let me just run it and then uh, what it will show us so let's see I'll provide this uh, formula in my video description so you can go ahead and then you can collect your uh, collect it so you can see here that uh, sum is uh, zero because it's as I mentioned like okay I, I, uh, I do I use the save divide so that's why it's uh, okay if I remove the save divide it will show us the error uh, so you can see that uh, this data set which one is I'm using from uh, the uh, public uh, that is uh, public uh, database uh, public uh, place and then you can see here uh, the size is, is showing 4.58 MB and 2.9 MB. So let me choose another one, uh, like uh, which one is having uh, more tables or something. Let's see. Okay, let's choose this one and just copy this data set and then after that, paste it here. Now run it. So let's see uh, what it's showing. So you can see here that all the tables uh, here we have in the, this data set so it's showing uh, some uh, size so this way you can just uh, estimate your cost and also you can estimate your the table size so based on that you can calculate also that your uh, you know uh, monthly cost uh, so if you guys uh, have any question or uh, concern anything regarding this video so please just uh, let me know uh, through the comment and if you like this video please uh, subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so thank you friend watching this video thank you very much